Cutting a scale, guys. Next to you, and welcome back to Destiny 2. And in today's video, we're back with more content. We got a new weapon, obviously, to review. It's actually an old weapon that got brought back in with Season of Dawn. Season of Dawn had a bunch of new ones, obviously, the same 14s and stuff like that. And it also brought back uh, some old weapons. And this one is from Base Destiny 2, and it is Last Hope. Now, Last Hope, as I said, was Base Destiny 2. This was really good back in the day. This was like the first sidearm, and it used to actually wreck. Especially because uh, PC came out after console, and on console, this sidearm destroyed in Trials of the Nine. I used it myself back in the day. Obviously, when we had double primaries, so there was no shotguns that could shut you down. But the last hope was amazing. And as I said, this is randomly rolled, so without further ado, let me go in and show you the roll I got. Last hope. Remember what you fight for. I mean, you know straight away this is the base Destiny 2 gun because of how bad it looks. This, all the guns back then just look like they came out of the, like garbage. It looks like they were wrecked and destroyed and they just picked them up and just started using them. But the last hope is an Amalon adaptive frame. Well-rounded, reliable, fires a three-round burst. For the side in this, it got short spec SAS, balanced sidearm side, increased stability, increased handling speed, slight increased strange. Or it could go for the far point SAS, which great increased strange, but decreased stability and decreased my handling speed. For the magazine, I got ricochet rounds, so rounds ricochet off hard surfaces, which increases range and also increased stability. Or it could go for armor piercing. For the traits, we got firmly planted, increased accuracy, stability, and handling while firing while crouched. And last but not least, we got a daddy trait, which is multi kill clip. Reloading grants increased damage based on the number of rapid kills made beforehand. You'll see in the screen now, though, all the different types of rolls you can get. This thing actually has a ton of really good rolls you can get. The roll I have isn't bad. I'm not going to say it's terrible or anything. I think it's actually decent enough. But you can see you can get quick draw, multi-kill clip, you can get quick draw, tap the trigger. Tap the trigger on these tree bursts is insane because tap the trigger basically procs every time you tap, every time you hit it because it's tree round burst. It's, it's really insane with the different types of rolls you can get. The only problem with this weapon is that it's very hard to obtain. There's no sure way of getting it or anything like that. Like, there's no real good farm. You basically have to get it from legendary engrams. Random drops outside the world. So that's what we're here to find out. If the base weapon with this sort of roll can do well, it's going to do well with all the god tier rolls as well. So without further ado, let's go in with the last hope. Alrighty, so we're going to be on the burnout itself. We're going to be going in with last hope. This uh, should be interesting. As I said, it's triple burst to sidearm. And we earn a sidearm meta. I don't care what people say. It's sidearm meta, boys! Apart from all the shotguns. Like that. <laughs> But yeah, side our meta, we just gotta spray a bunch of people like that, and uh, hopefully they aren't using shotguns. As I said, this this was really good back before um, the, obviously, shotguns and everything became irrelevant in terms of they were special weapons and stuff like that. So, ooh, look at that, with kill clip, this thing uh, starts to shred. But yeah, back when the special weapons weren't the thing, this was so good. It just used to melt up close quarters, and there was nothing that could really combat you and stuff, and that is just... A triple team of Unbrokens. But yeah, the thing was that this weapon actually, in terms of rolls now, this can actually roll with some really sweet weapon, like rolls and everything. Like, we obviously have the kill clip on this, but this can roll with a bunch of different interesting ones as well. I mean, it's... The possibilities are somewhat endless, and that's the shotgunner, and we'll get this guy. Ooh, there's the double kill. multi kick up by two. Oh, we are stacking shots and stuff. Oh, that's a meta top. Don't matter because we have a sidearm. Sidearm meta, boys. Sidearm freaking meta. We're actually getting a lot of kills. They don't know how to deal with it. They don't know how to deal with the sidearm meta. Woo! I'm gonna get that written on my tombstone, to be honest. Sidearm meta, sidearm meta, sidearm meta. What the hell? We are actually shredding people. Just gotta be real aggressive. Real super aggressive. We'll get this guy now. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy, whoever got absolutely destroyed there. The thing is, though, you can actually use it with this. And the thing with sidearms is, intrinsically, they have really good handling because they're built for being, like, not secondary weapons, but for using them secondary-ish. So what you can do with them is do something like this and... Oh, okay. Okay, that was just meant to top going in. That was nothing to do with the sidearm meta. Sidearm meta, boys. Hey, hey, guys. Hey, I have a sidearm and I don't know how to control it, but can you just, like, come toward me? There we go. This guy's a shotgun. It's a shotgun, but we got multi-kill clip. Oh my god, there's another guy up here. I'm so confused. Jump up. Go on. Hit someone. Oh, we hit someone. Oh, what the Kobe? The freaking Kobe, boys. Oh, there's someone behind me. Oh my, I'm so, so screwed. Okay, we're just going to have to start rushing people. Oh, that was a terrible jump. <laughs> oh, you know what, though? We're going to do this. Boom. Come on, boys. Come at me. Come at me. Come on. Hey, buddy. You know what? You can get killed by me. There we go. Ah, oh, bubble in all the right places right now. But honestly, I'm actually having a lot of fun with it so far. We'll uh, try to get this guy. Come on. Hit him. Hit him. Whew. Don't worry, boys. I saved the team. Save the team. PVJ and your stupid mind vendors. We saved, we saved it. We saved Christmas, basically, because he was going to be an absolute Grinch with that super. But we are uh, got sniped. Yeah, I think they're starting to realize that it's a sidearm meta. And they're starting to actually combat it. Whew. Oh, he just got melted. 
Oh, zero. I, I wouldn't be surprised if he left the game. Oh, God. The side I've destroyed him with the recluse going in. Freaking hell. How many people are using the freaking mind banners with a dodge roll? Oh, my God. Okay. We somehow dodged that. Don't ask questions. We're going to sneak around, though. Sneaky beaky like. I haven't even used the. Uh, oh, my God. This guy here with a stupid mind benders again. Oh, God. Yeah, that's. That's the. As I said, it's the one thing. That you gotta worry about with this is that side arms would be meta if they didn't give people shotguns that they could spam religiously for like god knows how long. Because that's all it is. Oh, what the okay, we'll get this guy. In fairness, I am playing on a really heavy shotgunning map, so I understand somewhat why they're all using it, but that's a sniper against this. Okay, he's a sniper. Come on, come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. There we go. We got the kill. We got the guy over here. He's miles back with a freaking sidearm of some sort. No, no. Ooh, shoulder charge? I think not. I think freaking not. We're shredding people. Come on, give me the kill clip. Give me the kill clip. Come on. Ah, damn it. 38 damage. And there's the assist. I should have reloaded after like the first kill and stuff. I would probably got both of them. But look, you can't see. You can spray pretty much. Like 27 bullets as well. It's not like it has a really small magazine. You get a lot of bullets for like it's banked for its bulk and stuff. But the thing is, I'm primarily going around with this and I am shredding. The thing is, you can, as I said, you can use this with... Uh, Mount to top and stuff like that. That would be like the best way to deal with this sort of shotgun nonsense that I'm coming up against. But apparently when I use this, <laughs> apparently when I use mount to top, I'm just like one tapping everyone with it. And there's a guy with like a Yotin here, I think. We'll get him, push him, push him. Let's rush, let's rush, let's rush. Rush, 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 rush strat. There's the kill. And multi kill clip going. Hey, buddy, your stupid shotgun. We'll get him. And yeah, there it is. When you get the kill clip going, it just absolutely destroys some shotgun noobs. We're going to go in the same position though. We're going <gasps> to... Oh, you son of a god, who did that? Who actually just absolutely wrecked my whole plan of action was to put the bubble there and I got suppressed. That's uh, that's that's depressing, to be honest. Get this guy though. Well, oh, freaking shotgun, man. Uh, last few kills though, actually, he's gonna be going in. Well, oh, 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 he's weak, he's weak, he's weak, he's weak, he's weak. Oh, we need a bubble. Can he actually get me up here? I have no idea. Oh, whoa. Woo, there is the mountain top going in. We have a. <laughs> <laughs> this is a pretty bad bubble to be honest. Oh, okay. That's oh, okay. There's a guy here. Hey, buddy Let's get this guy with multi-kill kit by two. We need to step up. Oh, let me up. Let me up. Let me up. I don't know where to go. Oh, uh, let me into my bubble. Where's my overshield, huh? Oh, he's using the sidearm though. I'll allow this guy. He's using the sidearm. He knows the sidearm matter. This is such a messy game. <laughs> But honestly, last soap, it feels just as good as it used to. I mean, it still holds up really well since year one and everything. Especially with the, like, target acquisition and stuff. But there is the kill. This guy is freaking shotgun. Can you just stop, please? I'm ruining his KD. I'm going to ruin his KD. Yeah, you're going to die. 38 kills altogether, though. 2.92. Like, honestly, what's more to say? Close quarters map, it just dominates. And we were primarily using this. We got a few kills. Well, like, two kills in the men's top. But last soap, everybody. If you get your hands in a good one of these, it will absolutely shred. Sidearm meta. Sidearm meta. Alrighty, so we're going into some PvE, obviously, with the last soap itself. And this is actually where I can actually practice with more and stuff. And I actually will go in as well. In terms of multi-kill clip, we'll actually stack and everything like that. In terms of roles, as I said, though, there's tons of different combinations. That's the beautiful thing about this. It's like the only sidearm which I've, I felt has them roles. And the thing is, I'll be able to showcase what this stability and everything is like with the frame of planted. Because this has a ton of stability. And it can become even better because there is a perk called uh, Top the Trigger. Which I did mention. Oh, we are. Ooh, we're getting some things. But Top the Trigger basically will proc. Every time you tap it, it will proc. Which gives it a ton of extra stability and stuff. So having that on a tree burst like this is actually really good. It'll make the stability with Fermi Planted just insane. So that is what you're meant to be kind of looking for. Especially because these are sidearms in general, like you can see. They're just so good at just dealing with small mobs and everything like that. And like, obviously, when you get the multi-kill clip by tree, it will shred. But if you want to know, like, what the difference and stuff is in terms of Fermi Planted and stuff, you'll see, like, if I shoot... Okay, where's a wall being going to? If I go to this tree and stuff and I shoot, you'll see it's sort of rising up. That's not... You're not controlling at all but if i stay on the thing look how like steady that is like i mean it barely goes up and stuff and it's directly linear it's really insane with how much fur we planted adds and that's another invader so uh can i hit crits please <laughs> thank you well yeah there is an invader in town we need to destroy him real quick and where is he where is he but honestly when it comes to uh pve and stuff i think the sidearms they do have a decent place it's really dope if you want to rush around and stuff like that i think when it comes obviously you're gonna have most people be like I'm not going to use the sidearm. I got special weapons. Like, obviously, I've got Mantis Top. And people are like, oh, that's my damage booster. I'll use something else just for, like, clearing mobs and stuff like that. Like, loose. Because, obviously, this is energy as well. So, yeah, when it comes to those sorts of things, <laughs> Pinnacles just ruin everything when it comes to reviewing weapons for, like, PvE. But if you want to go, like, this will be decent if you have it. Obviously, with, like, Frame of Panther, I can... 
get a lot more steadier and just absolutely destroy some things. But honestly, sidearms are something you shouldn't like look down on in uh, PVE. I think they're they have a really solid place, and we're gonna summon the Prime Eva right now. And like it doesn't take much to kill stuff. That's the thing with other stuff, it kind of like take a while and stuff like that. But with this one. It's actually pretty good, but uh, yeah, that is <laughs> that's it in PvE. Alrighty, so we're gonna be on console with the last soap. As I said, this is basically where it was like God for me. Anyway, it was uh, probably its best on console because obviously it was back when we had trials and stuff, and I've got hit by a freaking Arenta from behind. But yeah, it was back where I played trials with nine and stuff like that, and this was like the best thing because obviously there's no shotguns to combat and everything like that. So you can actually kill stuff, but now we have to actually start shredding some people. And oh my, I stopped shooting because I thought he was dead. Uh, there's a guy here though. Hey, buddy, can you just can you just die, please? There we go. Look at that shred. Ba -ba Boom! He's gone. We'll get the guy who just spawned over here. Hey, buddy. Buddy, 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 buddy. It's an arbalist, 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 arbalist. And I probably should have killed a guy who had the actual weapon that could kill me from that position. As far as sidearms go, this is like these tree burst Amalan ones are like some of the best. I think there's Division as well, which is a future war cult one. That is a really good one too. Like they are they are super good. They just do with tons of damage and everything. But we need to get more kills and stuff though. Oh, he's so weak. He's so freaking weak. He's so weak. He's so weak. He's so weak. No! I'm getting this guy. It's the last thing I freaking do. There we go. We actually got him. Go to my left. Oh my guys, can you please stop T shotting me? I just wanna have some fun with my last hope. I just wanna reminisce, okay? I just want to go in. So, like, unless you're in the good enough range and everything, you start to see you do somewhat, like, lose a lot of fights. But that's not, like, saying it's bad or anything. Like, you'll see, oh, the kill clip going in as well. Body is just shot in and it's dead. And I'm so screwed. Oh, my God, we need to run. Oh, my God. Please, please, please. Oh. <laughs> okay, he's AFK. I probably should just kill them normally instead of wasting my grenade. It's like, you can see, it does some crazy league. good damage, especially if you're, like, accurate with, like, your headshots and stuff like that. Like, he just got this melted. We need to pop a proper rifty boy. Rift it up, rift it up, rift it up, rift it up. Oh my god, I'm so screwed. I am so screwed. Can you uh, can you come over and help me, buddy? What, someone someone help me. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Oh, 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 where do we go? Where do we go? Where do we go? I need to run. I need to freaking run. Um, guys, please spawn over. I'm scared. I think I just wet myself. Oh my god, let's go here. Uh, uh, there we go. Crimson, screw you, buddy. Kill keep going, but I'm super weak. We are super... What? What? What is... What's this building? What the hell? I didn't even get the kill for that. Okay. <laughs> you know what? I somehow survived that whole ordeal, so I'll take that. We'll get this guy too. Oh, man. It's uh, it's so good for when you're like just dealing with people like running straight at you and stuff. It's just like, you just feel like you just nothing the enemy can do and stuff. Like, look, he's just dead. I think it's either me lagging or they're lagging. Don't know, but this guy with is there. And we'll shred his freaking face off. Guy here, though. We'll get his guy too. Multi kill clip going too. And... Boom! 10 kill streak, boys, with a sidearm. I mean, this is literally, this is, <laughs> this is Destiny 2 vanilla, like, in a freaking nutshell. This is what it felt like back in the day. This guy has to die. He has to die. There we go. Give me that, give me that sweet health regen. Whoa, whoa, boom! We'll get this guy. We'll get this guy. We'll get this guy. <laughs> Ah, oh, we are uh, destroying this guy over here somewhere. There he is. Hey, buddy. Boop. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to go in here. Did not mean to go in here. Uh, we are in enemy lines, ladies and gentlemen. We are in enemy lines, and that's a freaking a rental. We got him weak as well. Oh, man, what was that? 15 kill streak we got onto? I mean, this is with the role that um, I'm kind of not even using the firmly planted. Like, I haven't crouched much at all. So then you could literally, I think, God roll would realistically be quick draw and something else. Because if I was using the mental top as well, I could get people super weak. Week, and then pop out the L, uh, pop out the L last word just to finish them off and everything. We'll get this guy though. Come on, push me, push me while I have. Oh no, it's a freaking a rental. It's a rental. So I'll get this guy though, real quick. Come on, come on. Oh, the stupid aim assist. I don't want to attack him. I want to attack that guy. Yeah, there we go. We'll get this guy with Arbalus. Um, okay, give me that assist because <laughs> I missed like every shot. Well, let's start rushing though. We need a rush, 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 rush. Oh, that's a sidearm. So sword, is it? Oh uh, no, it's not. I was gonna say actually shotgun. Like, that's the one thing, as I said, it, it, there was literally a playlist with uh, just normal weapons, like just kinetics and stuff like that. I'd actually be just absolutely destroying everyone. Oh, come on. No. Uh, I did. Why did I not repunch? What the hell? We get this guy, though, who has a pulse rifle. We'll shred him. Oh, he has the crimson, actually. Crimson v. Sidearm. We both reverse, then we both shred. I wonder who's going to win, though. <laughs> <laughs> the sidearms apparently I think actually do more damage or something like that. We'll get this guy as well. Like as I said, like I'm primarily going around with this and I'm actually starting to like wreck some people. If you're using this primarily just as a weapon, or as a, if you're using this with something else, just like as a secondary thing, 
You see, you will just shred. And that's the thing. These do so much damage. This guy's so close. No, no, I'm dead. I'm, I'm so dead. We got one last super, I think, though. So we're going to pop it. Hey, buddy. Come here. Come here. Don't try to get away. <laughs> oh, no. It's a freaking thing. Oh, we survived. What the hell? Oh, he's so annoyed, I'd say. How did he... How did I win that? I have no idea. But we're just popping this everywhere. Okay, I have no idea how we've survived the Blade Barrage. But games are over. Let's try to get across. Come on, buddy. Uh, let me get some shots in. Okay, this guy here. Why did, I, why did it shoot? No, why didn't it shoot? This is some good feeling stuff. This is like back to what it was and stuff like that. This guy here. No, I freaking need to read out for kill clip. Oh, uh, game is just about over. Let's just sit in our rift and stuff and like sit down. Can I sit in this? No, that's dancing. No, okay, that's the wrong one. I, I don't have a city mode on. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, but how do we do all together though? 37 kills, 2.18. Again, this is on console. We got 37 kills with just a sidearm. Well, that's it from me and the last hope sidearm. Honestly, in terms of how effective this thing is, you can see, even on, like, if I broke it down anyway, for PC, PvP, this thing was really good. Obviously, sidearms in general are decent, but shotgun metas and everything like that do shut you down and a lot more so i think on pc because obviously you can get around quicker and stuff so even though you can rush people with the sidearm as i said hand cannons as well can shut you down real far up like up close and they're a lot more reliable obviously for range but in terms of effectiveness it actually was pretty sweet in terms of like you could do a lot of damage if you get like up close and stuff when you get the multi -kill, going, kill clip going as well it starts to absolutely shred and i think overall on pc pvp it's actually really good when it comes to pve i will say these guns are really good as well they're really good for dealing with mobs and everything like that of course they fire so fast this one does anyway it does a lot of damage as well and you get the kill clip stacks as well but obviously in pve they're definitely just for dealing with mobs they're not going to be doing any tank busting or anything like that which is fine and then when it comes to pvp on console this thing is back to its former freaking glory this thing is back where it belongs last hope as i said d d d2 year one back when trials and i was out last hope was insane and this is back there. It's like it's become its own meta again, just because of these random rolls. But overall, the last top, as I said, it's a really good sidearm. Sidearm meta, guys. Sidearm meta is the thing you want to be going for. But regardless, if you like the video, trust like, and if you want to see more content, subscribe. Fantastic day. And hopefully, I'll see you guys in the next one.